um, this video will tell you how to use screen events to make it so something appears and disappears from the screen um, in a way so the participants always see certain information while other information changes. So, well, let's give an example. So, in this example, we want our participants to imagine an experience and then write about what they think and feel. Um, however, we want this instructions to stay at the top here um, throughout the whole task. Um, and as we can see, once the participant clicks continue, they still have this thing at the top, but they get five seconds here to imagine going on a first date. Once that happens, it changes to then giving them 60 seconds to write about their thoughts and feelings that they had when they were imagining going on this date. So as you can see, the imagination tax task instructions from the first part from the first one of the first screens is still here at the top we just were adding more information for the participant um, so how do you do this um, in the task builder well it is important to remember that even though what the participant sees is a certain screen with more and more information appearing what we are actually doing in the gorilla task builder is representing each change with a different screen and then having several screens in a row with slightly different things on them so the fixation cross was the first thing, and that's just a normal fixation cross. Um, and then we have the first text that the participant sees, which asks them to imagine an experience and then write about your thoughts and feelings right at the top. Um, on the next screen, we've added a rich text zone and we've added the time limit zone. Um, and so, but we've also remembered to keep the rich text zone with the imagination task instructions at the top. Um, and then on the third screen, we've added even more information changed the time limit and added a response zone. But as you can see, this first rich text zone talking about, like, imagine your experience is still there. And so even though for a participant, this might look as though this is just one screen with information appearing, 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 um, the way we build it is have several screens in a row, each slightly different.